this particular visit has become necessary because of some reports that I have. Reports that officers, and there are nine or so agencies represented in any passport application center, that these people represented from the various agencies, and I will not say that my own officers are not part of it, but these people are involved in illegal activities. And when I say illegal activities, we all know, just two days ago, the report um, in, in, in the Daily Guide that the, 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 the issue of Goro people involved in our passport acquisition process has become rife. It is wrong. How can 100 Ghana for standard service to acquire a passport and 150 for expedited service bump, be bumped up to 2,000 and 3,000? And here they don't even charge 2,000 now. They are charging 3,000. And it's wrong. But I can say, and we all would agree, that a Goro person is outside the passport office. They need somebody inside to work with. They cannot do it on their own. People are paying 3,000, 2,000 to acquire passports. Why should this be so? And sometimes they don't even, they don't even, even, even carry out the, the, the so-called service that they promised them for charging them so much. The stories are horrific stories. People's experiences are not the best. 